What's up guys, Johnny here back with another Call of Duty Mobile. We got some new bundles in the shop today guys. We are going to check them out because looks like we have another controversy here today guys. And the posts are already raining on Reddit about these bundles. So let's check it out guys. Before we start, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for daily COD Mobile videos. Let's go. So let's start with the first one, the blue one, the Traveler Bundle, guys. It's the left Kravchenko skin that is back in a bundle. We knew already it was going to come back because of the leaks before the season. But look at the price, guys. 600 cut points for the Kravchenko. The rest, I don't think it's very rare. Uh, maybe old stuff, though. So if you're a new player and you miss these, uh, you're going to get them as a bonus. But basically, 600 cut points for a soldier skin is as good as you're gonna get guys and this one i mean compared to the other one this one's 600 the agent brooks bundle is 700 now tell me why because i thought the kravchenko skin was maybe harder to find or harder to get terence brooks was in the daily crates for i think three straight seasons right and kravchenko appeared on season two for a little while and then it was gone and then it came back in some events you could get a few crates here and there but i think this one was like much harder to find i mean you had less opportunities to get it and it is cheaper than the terence brooks one that is 700 so i don't know what they this why they decided to do that uh maybe because you get more cool stuff on top on the terence brooks crate but anyways uh for sure i will buy this now the controversy is some guys were very happy that they had this super rare skin because it's almost impossible to get now it is impossible to get you cannot buy it you can only get the crate and if you got lucky you got it if you didn't get lucky you didn't but still the players that got it uh they got it for free because it's not like they paid like a hundred dollars or, or fifteen hundred dollars for a skin you know they just got it for free and they got lucky and the guys that didn't get lucky, they can't get it. So, I don't know. But, yeah, the rarity is going to take a drop here, guys. Because it's cheap. Everyone can get it. It's a pretty cool skin. But on the flip side, everyone has a free Kravchenko skin also uh, from the new seasonal challenges. Uh, which one is better? I guess it's personal. But this one's the OG one. And it looks pretty, pretty badass. I like this a lot. I kind of had to buy it. So, uh, yeah, leave a comment below, guys, what you think about that one. That's the first one. And we have another bundle, guys. Now, the next one, also a bit controversial, the Executive Depot 2 bundle. And this one has the Arctic 50 Black Gold. I'm pretty sure there was a crate not that long ago, Arctic 50 Black Gold crate. So that one is a money uh, crate and it's pretty expensive to find or to buy many crates if you're not lucky. If you're lucky, you get them for cheap. Um, and the next one is the AK-47 from the Clan Crates. And this, according to Reddit, it could be one of the rarest skins in the game. But once again, it is a free skin. So it's not like people actually paid for it. It's just the ones that got it, they just got lucky. And it's not like they had to pay. You cannot buy these Clan Crates. You can just play and get them every week. Now, if it was just that, someone tagged me on this course. says, check out the new bundle, the AK-47 here. I've been opening crown crates forever, guys, and I just didn't get it. And seeing the price here at 1,400 cut points, I would never buy the crate just for the AK-47. I would have said, no tanks. I'll just keep playing, and maybe someday I'll get it in the crown crates. And if I don't get it, well, it's just the AK-47. It's not the weapon I use the most, honestly. And I got some really good skins for AK-47, so I don't really need it. But the Arctic 50 Black Gold, Black Gold is one of my favorite camos in the game. I try to get all these for Battle Royale. Uh, I bought the ASM-10, I got the J358 Magnum, uh, and probably another one, uh, the M4 LMG. So 100% I, I will buy for 1400 God points, the Arctic 50 Black Gold. For me, it is worth it. I don't know about you guys. You guys think maybe it's a bit expensive. I don't know it's like between 10 and 20 dollars depending where you live and on top of that i get the ak as a bonus but it's not like i'm gonna use it that much so anyways guys uh that one maybe sucks for the guys that had to pay a lot of money for it because now you get it for cheap 
but are you surprised for real because uh, if you want to talk about uh, controversial stuff well i didn't make a video about this but they added the medieval bundle last week and that is like the most controversial move they made because i know you guys know by now ferg paid about a fifteen hundred dollars when this crate came out because there was two epics uh, i think it was the m4 lmg the other one and he kept getting the same one and he didn't get that one so the drop rate for purple is like maybe 0.8 percent that time and you just get the same duplicate duplicate until you get that one and now you can have it for 20 bucks so that is crazy but it's a long time ago again and uh now you have some dupe protections or duplicate protections in some of these crates so maybe it wouldn't happen again but anyways uh that was the move guys they decided to add old stuff in the bundles including soldier skins and that one i have so i don't have to pay for it but yeah i uh, cannot wait to read you guys comments because uh every time they do something some players will be happy some players will be unhappy but i have to repeat myself guys be respectful of others opinions because yeah i don't like to see guys fight over stupid stuff like that i mean i don't know i i will read everything i checked the reddit also like this was posted less than an hour ago and uh it's already heating up so check out the reddit also guys and that will be it for now so uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next one if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like and uh, don't forget to subscribe for daily cut vids peace out take care bye bye